There we go. Mic check, mic check. Okay, that's working. That's Isaac working. And his mother lived alone in a small house wow. on a hill. It's nice Isaac that things are working. Himself. Drawing pictures and playing with his toys as his mom watched Christian broadcasts on the television. Life was simple, and they were both happy. That was until the day Isaac's mom heard a voice from above. Your son has become corrupted by sin. He needs to be saved. be pretty good to get box fly right off the bat. I don't really know. Check mic to ooh, I'm getting a little bit of feedback there. Let me fix that. Let's test. All right, let's see if we can get lucky and maybe get a Bethany unlock while we're testing this. is taking so oh my god so oh that was fair wow that's awful uh hello 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 you're wearing that t-shirt i see in the thumbnails uh it's not a t-shirt it's a shirt but so it's also the one I wore last night on the hangup. Because I got up this morning and had an appointment at the eye doctor. And I have a debate in a few hours, so I'm testing out the tech. Uh, in part by playing a little Isaac. Lucky. Maybe we can get a Bethany unlock. That's why, that's why I'm trying to do my first Lazarus run. If we get lucky and win it, unlock Bethany. I really want to play Bethany because she looks like one of the most interesting characters in the game. That and Kane's crafting is kind of interesting. Yeah, I had to go get uh, new glasses, uh, a new prescription. 
So they were going to be like 500 bucks or something. And then I went over to Walmart and got them for significantly cheaper. But while I was there, I got tired of, because every time I grab my phone, I can't read it. My prescription's gotten so bad. So I talked myself into getting a cheap pair of the off the shelf uh, reading glasses. And when I put them on, I can read my phone clearly. It's awesome. I mean, boom, it's great. However, I can't see the screen. So they're only good like here and not, not any further than like a foot away. And then they make me sick. So I got to wait a week for my regular prescription to get in, which hopefully won't make me sick. But if so, I might have to go to switch to like some bifocals or something. All right. Well, we lost a lot of life in this room. This orbital. I don't know what this orbital does. It's called Botfly and it's got its defense stuff, but I don't know if it does damage on contact or if it shoots at stuff or what. I should take you like, well, that's because you're far sighted or you're, you're near sighted. I'm Far side. I, my, my distance vision is perfect and has been has been perfect or better than perfect for my whole life. It's just the up close stuff I can't do anymore. Wow. Look like it may have done damage. Does anybody know about Botfly? It's definitely doing contact damage. It's not very much. And it orbits so fast that uh, I don't know how useful it is. I didn't need glasses when I was 40 either, Julie. Keep talking shit about your jeans and then come talk to me in 10 years. Granted, it was, I needed the mildest of prescriptions when I was like 42 or 43. What's the game plan for the debate tonight? What well, wouldn't you like to know? Um, I'm gonna challenge the notion that it's reasonable to accept that the resurrection occurred. Kind of want to go in here, but I just don't have the health for it and I'm not playing that great. So.
don't have any coins. Keep going. Hey, thanks for the tip, Northern Spike. Is it on modern day debates? No. It's on pints with Aquinas. Can't post links, Exeus. You think you have good eye genes, but I was just explaining to you that I could have said the same thing when I was 40. Let me. Here's the link to the debate. What a silly thing. Until my dad had cataract surgery and now doesn't need glasses at all. He only need glasses for reading and driving at night. He could get by without them. Well, I only need glasses for reading too. Uh, and have been for ages. Hello, Melly. I already played Doom Eternal Tag 2. I don't know what Tag 2 is, but I played Doom Eternal. This show was fun to watch. Thank you, Sedan. No, I don't wear them full time. Like, I can see the screen, although it's blurry because my prescription's old, but I can't really see. I have to look over them to see the TV and everything. I only wear them when I'm in front of a computer screen, but you always see me when I'm in front of a computer screen. If you go look at Atheist Experience, where I'm sitting there and the camera's a ways away and I don't have a screen to look at, I don't wear glasses when I'm in the studio. And, despite needing a better prescription, my distance vision is still perfect. I don't think it does look smarter, but I'll take it. All right. Well, we've spent nine and a half minutes or ten minutes on the first floor and haven't even fought the boss yet because I'm playing like ass and talking to people. Oh, my gosh, it's Pin. Jesus Juice on the day of the debate. Definitely taking Jesus Juice. Damage and range up. Cool. Who was scheduled to co-host the hang-up last night that couldn't make it for whatever reason or was the plan to solo it? There was never anybody scheduled. <coughs> <coughs> the original plan for the show was to only have co-hosts on rare occasions, that it was just going to be me most of the time, but we've had so much fun with Andrew and everybody else that I kind of like having co-hosts on occasion. But no, the plan was just for me. Sorry. The big question is, does a photon experience time? Yes, for my frame of reference. Do you plan on playing the Doom Eternal DLC? Uh, I have no objection to playing it. It's I don't plan to play anything. I don't have uh, set games. I'm going to play this for a while and unlock some stuff, but I've got a debate tonight. I always wondered back when you were in the studio. By the way, tag me if you have a question. That way I don't miss it. 
When you were in the studio for the Atheist Experience, how did you know what camera to look at? Was there a light or someone behind it directing you to look over? It always looks so smooth and professional. Well, on the old shows in the public access studio, there were static cameras uh, with lights, but the lights didn't normally work. So we would just look at a preview screen. But um, in the studio now, there's only one camera. There's one camera that shoots the table and then they chop up the, the close-up shot is a zoom in on it. So you put a 4K camera in, you can still get 1080 in two shots. Oh, bullshit. How you take spike damage just walking down a straight fucking hallway? That's, that's my sloppy fingers there. I think Botfly deflects projectiles. So maybe he's better than I thought. Love to stop taking bad damage. Uh, that's um. Best way to prep for debate is to find an empty warehouse and dance your heart out. Well, I guess that could work. Is a time to dance. Fortunately, that debate didn't require any prep because he was able to use the Bible against the Bible. I can't do that. It's very different when your opponent has a position that can be proved wrong rather than one that just can't be proved true. find it hilarious that there's people who absolutely believe in the resurrection and yet won't put a fucking mask on or take the vaccine. live on Twitch. Love your work in the atheist experience. Thanks, Lil Nut. Is it bad to watch problematic YouTubers to see their views and arguments for things since it supports them and makes YouTube recommend their videos to others? Possibly. I don't know. Who are you debating later and what's the topic? Trent Horn. Is it reasonable to believe in the resurrection? NVIDIA has cheered 150 bits. Happy belated birthday. Found Atheist Experience on YouTube a month ago, so ago. Binging it out since very... Thanks! Are you ripping off Sin Victa's name, or is coincidence? I haven't saw your playthrough of Doom Eternal. Just wanted to say the DLC are a lot harder than the base game. Not sure if that's your thing or not. I love Doom Eternal. It's one of the best Doom games of all time, but... person to find it reasonable. I have to be willing to suspend credulity and reasonability. Sorry, Bill Marker, but that... How's the puppy doing in his new home? Fine. Ooh, we got a library over here? Can't get in it. Ah, this game fucking hates me. That's cheating. Uh, 
Oh my god, how is that fair? Those guys aren't even supposed to blow up. I didn't think those guys were supposed to blow up. Well, we're not going to get the unlock. And we have no keys, so... Alright. Exit. New game. Try it again. My friend is upset with me for watching Steven Crowder's latest video. I barely know who Steven Crowder is. We got a sack room. All right. Oh my God, give me enough room to move around. Put fucking pink fatties in here. This game cheats so fucking hard. Yes, I know it doesn't actually cheat. That's fun to say. All right, so we lost a heart in a tiny room. Cracked mirror. I think that's bad. Oh, no, that's gonna be fine. That should be okay. Because then I get a chance to maybe hit him more than once. No, 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 as soon as it hits him, Northern Spike just tipped $50. Wow! You're just tipping like crazy, Northern Spike. You feeling okay? I don't want to take all your money when I'm just doing a test stream here. I mean, granted, I'll, I'll take it, but... I did a video testing if the knee on the neck killed George Floyd. You, you can't do a test for that. You can only test for it by watching the knee on the neck kill George Floyd in the fucking video. That's all you can do. You can't do the test with somebody else because you can't do what it takes to kill somebody. And that somebody doesn't have the same physical characteristics as George Floyd. I can't believe, I would, there's no way in hell I'd fucking watch a video like that when we're watching a trial to convict someone of something we've all seen. Fuck Crowder. He's just asking questions. He's just a shitlord. The defense is cringe, but it's supposed to be. They have to do everything in their power to provide the best defense for their clients possible. Um, I'm gonna use a bomb to get a key because I have four bombs and no keys. No, that's not normally. Wow. Um, I'm gonna use another bomb to get another key. Six and D20. What's this pill? Tears up shot speed. Take that and come back for the dice shard. Dog food, get hopefully soul hearts. Soul heart, come back at this dice shard. see the full map on this. Q. 
Keep me going. You're very important. Thank you very much, Northern Spike. I appreciate it. Considering it's been the most expensive week of the last couple of years, uh, including a $1,500 laptop that is a brick right now, although I have to deal with that tomorrow, uh, I'm at least doing okay. I've got, I'm, I'm on my meds. I'm checking my sugar. I'm, I've got my insulin. Uh, I went and got a new glasses prescription. It'll take like seven to 10 days for it to show up. And I'm pretty sure that I'll have headaches and feel awful for a little while, but at least I'll be able to read your comments and maybe reply. Who knows? All right, let's see. We've got um, secret room and one bomb. So here we go. Well, all right, I'll take my bomb back. And now it becomes, do we go into the challenge room or whatever it's called, or we just go onto the next floor? I'll lose that soul heart. I think it's better for me to go to the next floor and keep the soul heart maybe to get a devil deal. I play better. How old were you when you first in your glasses? It's 2013, so 40. 40, 41, and I only needed them. I didn't need them. I could still read just fine. I was noticing it was taking longer for me to shift focus from far to near. And so they gave me this incredibly light prescription. It was like 0.75 in one and 0.5 in the other just to reduce eye strain when I was working on the computer. And that's the same prescription that I'm wearing right now. Uh, although, when I 44 in 2013? Oh yeah, I did the math backwards, whatever. I don't know how old I was. Gosh, if you know so much about me, Julie, why'd you have to ask a question in the first fucking place? <laughs> just curious, what do you think about new age religions? Like what? Yesterday I was a party watching with two pagans, the hidden human history on YouTube, and turns out it beats Kent Hovind debates in categories of bullshit per minute. Yeah. It, it's not about whether or not it's a religion or a new religion or a new age religion. New age is sewage. S-E-W-A-G-E, -E, put it all together, sewage. That's what James Randi would say. It's a bunch of bullshit woo. Uh, all right, let's go. So I'd like to get a Bethany unlock and then eat and finish doing the prep for the debate tonight. Curse of the Lost. Well, of course I get uh. Petrified poop. Three and a half damage is unbelievably bad. Where can we watch the debate tonight? How come it wasn't creepy to you when some random person sent you in? It wasn't a random person. I've, I answered this the last time you asked. It wasn't a random person. It was Great Sky, who's in chat all the time here in the show. It wasn't stalking. They asked me about it before. I don't know them, but they sent me underwear. I thought you asked me that exact same question last time I was here streaming. Or something. I could have swore that it was... I, I could be wrong. 
probably am. You asked me to PM and I didn't answer. Oh. Yeah. I, I just knew I'd seen the question from you, so sorry I didn't answer that. PM. I've, it's been a shit week. Um, that's not Yumheart. That's, um... Just hit point up. Okay. Women always send me their panties, too. Did not know guys do this. That's not what happened, but nice joke. What is the tequila you are drinking called? I'm not drinking any tequila right now. Uh, but... There's the name. I'm starting to get hungry. Okay, hang on. Uh, since I don't have a map, I have to memorize the map. So here we are. It's two. Skip that. That could be a secret room. Especially now that I've seen that. That's a whole lot of bombs needed or flying. Damn it. Tears are freaking me out because I thought something was firing a tear at me. And it was. It's just that I got confused between the red one and the white one. Alright, so we're out of soul hearts. God damn it, there goes my fucking devil deal chance. I hate spiders in this game. So fucking much. Well, it's not a modern day debate, so I'm expecting the chats to be considerably better. Dave on top TV. Hope all's good. Thanks for your atheist debates. Thank you so much, Dave. Appreciate it. going to get a better chance for a deal with the devil. How fucking shitty that I lost my deal chance right before this. Well, alright. I would have lost it right there anyway. Wow. Jumps are a little faster. It feels that way. to me anyway. Nope, I'll take the range up. Um, Alright, well I know I left hearts on the floor somewhere around here and there's rooms I still haven't cleared, so... Damn it. I didn't have to do that either because the poop can't hurt me. Oh my god! You can't come out through that gap at that angle and still hit me. That's unbelievable. That is unbelievable! Alright. Well, at least we got a soul heart. 
Uh, this. And some more coinage. See what's in. Oh, I don't have a key for the fucking store. Did I have a mullet in the 80s? No, I was in the United States Navy. You can't have a mullet. Actually, I guess since I graduated in 87, I possibly could have had a mullet in high school. But no, I didn't. Should watch non sequitur, but the host had some drama and it turned into dumpster fire. Yes, it did. You completed Hades. No. My cousin Ryan had a ridiculous looking one with spikes in the front. Hades does. Hey, man. It's all flock of seagulls. If you don't look like flock of seagulls, what's, what's doing? No, I was a fundamentalist, conservative, Christian kid. I wasn't going to look like... Ah, oh, bullshit. Those guys steal a charge. Um, okay, well, we need coins. Or we need keys to be able to get into the store. So, I think we'll do this. Bite me. Troll bomb. Don't bite me. This is the bird thing. That's an interesting way to go about it, but yeah, now we got the blood bag for that, so hooray. Uh, still not one fucking key. I guess I could risk, I could go ahead and give up the, the... Oh, man. All right. We need... Well, I don't even know if the key would do me... I mean, I do have enough for a, 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 an activated item, so... All right, let's see if we can get... Oh. And jump hit points down. That sucks. Still got the dice shard, but there was one more heart around here somewhere. All right, let's get the hell out of this floor. Slow as shit. your church think rock music and styles associated with it were evil? I don't know what my church thought. Um, I burned in a lot of my rock records at one point because of backward masking, yes. But I don't think my church taught me that. But they definitely thought that, you know, secular music was of the devil and modern database is more like the unbelievable show. I think Matt and audience would like the format a lot better. My Justin Briarly show? They managed to talk shit about me after I left, which I was a little disappointed in. But having a math background, theist arguments that compare God to the numbers is zero or one are the idea of infinity the most known. But theist arguments typically trigger you the quickest. Um. I don't know. I don't know that. It, I don't know. You probably have to ask somebody else. I don't know that any of them trigger me. I don't. I just. Pascal's wager is tiring. Have you ever been confused with the guy from Pawn Stars? Yes. 10, 12 years ago. Uh, there was a thing on the uh, website where you could, like, think of a celebrity and it would ask you questions and it'd be like, is this guy bald? Does he have a goatee? 
And um, if you were thinking of me, you would get Rick from Pawn Stars until they eventually, some people uh, donate to F. Wow, Northern Spike, you are, uh, you are en fuego. Uh, thank you so much. Where'd you get the idea to do it, TV preachers? I don't remember, Julie. I don't have, I don't understand people who remember shit that happened 20, 30, 40, 50 years ago. I just don't understand that. I can barely tell you what happened five years ago. I have no idea where I got the idea. It was a just so sort of thing. You just believed it and you did what you were told and what you were convinced of. I just want an eBay bid for a new open box desktop with a GTX 1070 for 800 plus tax and shipping. Today's a good day. Outstanding. Awesome. I'm sure it was an evangelist somewhere who, you know, played the black back masking stuff for us. I mean, we didn't have the internet, so not completely sure what that is. Is there a weird black? Oh, no, 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 no. All right. I thought there was something weird there. I understand people who don't remember stuff like that. Their house they lived in until 11 had two kitchens. Well, that's the kind of thing I would remember. I mean, I can tell you my address. Oh, actually, I can't tell you my address. I can tell you my phone number from when I was a little kid. That was 4367423 because it was drilled into me to remember and I had to go to school and, and but I couldn't tell you the address and I can kind of maybe describe the house a little bit, but uh, nah. Thank you again, Northern Spike. Awesome. Another streamer, a 675309 that's Tommy Two-Tone, Jenny Jenny. That stuff I can remember. Another streamer I watched talked about how he's had to sit down and write out significant things and when they happen some point there are just too many memories for the or think sponge to handle i figure if i don't remember it why should i care about it i don't need to keep it I, no i need i need to start keeping a diary but not for those reasons i need to track what i'm eating and when and what my blood sugar is and all that stuff as part of you know the getting healthier thing but i mean no offense but over the last 50 years i've met a lot of people i don't there are people who i was good friends with in the navy and i can't tell you their name Uh, the ones I was best closest friends with I can because there was Chris White and Derek Bonick and, and my roommate was um, Mike Burkhouse and of course I mean other friends that I still keep in touch with like Russell not Lasser but Loveday I know people who remember what happened to them when they were two or three is what they'll tell me. I don't know how you prove that, and I don't know why. All right, so we've done the arcade. I guess we, wow. I guess we just get the fuck out of here. Hang on, am I? Okay, first thing we're gonna go to options, do the HUD offset. do mini HUD. Now I can actually see the shit on the screen. Well, the thing is, do you remember things from when you were two or three because you remember them? Or is it because people have told you and now you're not remembering what actually happened? You're remembering what people told you. I'm confused. I have Curse of the Lost. There's a dead end here. Okay, this is the route. I have five bombs. I'm tempted to go in and get all that. I'm not blowing a bomb for two coins. I don't see any... We still don't have a key for the store, and that's what we went looking for before. I, I see. I forgot. I don't even remember what I was looking for. You get every penny of the donations here, right? No. No. If you if you're one to make sure that I get every penny, the best thing to do is just send it directly via PayPal, because uh, those do, I, I mean they don't take much. I will get a good chunk of it. 
but I don't mind so much if the service that's allowing me to communicate with people takes a chunk of it in order to stay live. That's good. Uh, but there's almost no place where I'm going to get every penny because I'm not a nonprofit. It's occurred to me what happened was this. I brought up two incidents, one of which my mom was present for and one other she wasn't. One she was present for, she confirmed happened. The other one she wasn't there for, but when I described the scene, she confirmed the room was set up that way. Drive down to Austin and hand the money to Matt directly. That's, that's an option, uh, you know. All right, let's keep going. I need to get some spirit parts. Equate God to the number infinity, which just... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Infinity is a concept, not a quantity. The second they start talking about how they've quantified infinity or I've counted, you know, they might as well be saying they've counted to infinity. Yes, that's annoying as fuck. It just doesn't happen all that often. But yes, I can understand your frustration with it. Huh. Oh, and now I don't know how much health I have. Oh, I got stuck in the little notch on the doorway. I'm lucky I didn't take more damage right there. Alright, this is fucking awful. I have a soul heart, but my devil is down to 36%, so I'm not getting that. Oh, by the way, that's a tended rock. And yet, I still don't have any fucking keys. Wow, that's just nuts. Or maybe just, like, find the item room. That'd be really handy. I needed to not be diagonal for me. Still did it. Yeah. Oh my god, boomerang tears are awful when you need range. God, it's part of the infinite set of things that don't exist. Another one, there's a study about people's memories mutating after 9 11. go. I did find the secret room. What's my money, which I'm not going to give it. I need keys so that I can get into the item room. Wow. Wow. Oh, bullshit. All right. There's a key. Really? Okay, well, we used our dice shard and we got a little friendly fly. to use your orbital, Matt. You're doing better with orbitals. Hooray. I 
I don't know what my youngest memory is because I have home movies and I've watched those home movies 15, 20 times. I mean, there was a period of time where, you know, our family would get together and be like, oh, let's watch the home movies, you know, for the holidays since we're stuck inside. And this was before the internet, there wasn't anything to do. But now it's like, well, when Kristen and I got together, I pulled him out when she came down to visit the first time to watch home movies because it gives somebody insight into my life and growing up. Uh, I never said you. Oh my god. Oh my god. Lots and lots of bad damage today. That's fair though, I'm way out of practice. God damn it. Could you fire a little faster? I don't know how much life I have, but probably not much. <laughs> Holy crap. Well, if we don't die here... God. Where did that damage come from? Oh my god, no wonder it's not working. I'm sitting here typing. Hey Matt, are you an atheist? Yes. again. Oh my. Fuck you. There we go. I don't want cursing. Let's let's start with a chance. Welcome to the channel, Jen Wu. You're, you've you've posted exactly one message, and it wasn't hi. It wasn't. It was just, "Hey, Matt, are you an atheist?" Yes, I am. Why do you ask?
Just notice that apparatus next to you with the big blue thing. Sorry if I wasn't paying attention if you already said it. What is it? It's a microphone. It's the way you can hear me answer your question. Hello, Jin Wu. Are you going to answer? God damn it. Just checking you didn't convert back to Christianity. And you decide... I'm so sick of fucking... I just... Okay. So it's, it's, it's there's the link to the debate. It just shocks me when somebody comes into chat, has never interacted before, you're operating under a pseudonym, I don't know you, I'm the guy who's here every day under attack and being trolled, and you're just like, hey, are you an atheist? I just wanted to check you didn't convert back to Christianity. Learn how to fucking talk to people. Next time, come in, say hi, introduce yourself, get a feel for the fucking room. It's annoying as fuck. Hey. So, you, you, sorry it was a joke, you didn't mean to be rude. So normally, do you walk into a room full of people that you don't know and who don't know you and start off with a joke? A, a joke that nobody's going to get but you. Is that the way you normally do things? Because if so, <laughs> Jesus. Just genuinely don't understand people. Hey, I'm in here. Nobody knows who I am, but I'm going to tell a joke that only I get as my first comment ever. Okay, cool. Bro, you're heated for no reason, chill. Welcome to Ban Bitch. I just explained to you that I'm the guy who's in here under attack. You're in my fucking house, and don't you fucking ever tell me to chill, which you won't get to do anymore, because your ass is banned. Bye. Bro, chill. You don't know me. You don't know what my life's fucking like. Tell you what, I no longer feel like playing this, so... We're going to, uh... Exit that. And I'll do something else for a few minutes before I have to go eat lunch and finish up my debate prep. This was just a quick thing to test the stream anyway. So... Those of you who don't aren't public figures, if you're not a public figure who puts yourself out there and allows people access so that you are trolled all the time, I'm sorry that you don't understand it. And if you think I'm an asshole, fine. 
If that's the way you feel about it, go away. I'm not doing this to make other people happy. It's just so fucking bizarre to me that, you know, oh, I have no social skills. I don't know how any of this stuff. Let me walk in and tell a joke that's only funny to me that I'm the only one that knows. And here I am genuinely wanting to interact with the person and find out, oh, you know, hey, did you, were you just not sure? Did you not recognize me? Were you worried about this? Did you want to have some kind of discussion? I'm, I'm in the mode where if somebody types something in chat, I would like to address it. I would like to find out what's going on uh, because there's a number, the, the regulars in here can tell you that people show up in here and they're just like, I mean, well, it's trolls all the time. I get, I'm banning a Nazi left and right or whatever. But my house, my rules. If you don't like it, you can lump it. Ooh. Let's see. I'm going to see if I can. I haven't reset up everything since I put in the new hardware. Here we go. All right, so that's now updated. Here we go, I'm gonna play some chess. If you play chess and you wanna come over to chess.com and challenge me, I play whoever challenged me, as long as it's five minutes or less, bullet or blitz only. I know, I, I get it, man to man. I'm not, I'm not bitching at the rest of you. I know people appreciate it, and I know most people aren't like that, but it's like every day, Somebody comes in who just doesn't know how to act. And then and then decides when I try to explain it to him uh, that I'm the fucking problem here. Everything was fine until you came walking in, but I'm the problem. Anyway, uh, I'm going to play a bullet game against a random person, but if you're going to challenge, say something in chat so that I know. And um, probably only going to play a couple games. Are you going to get two pawns out of this? You're going to drop a queen back. That's what I thought. Oh, I missed that.
God, it was awful, and I lost on time. Let's see. Yeah, go ahead, Kavid. If you're at Sartre, um, summaries of Sartre, no, no camas. Hello, my brother. I called you earlier, uh, but you, you was a busy, and it's not important. Um, I was wanting to find out roughly how much you paid for your last pair of glasses because uh, I had to go get some. And they were wanting almost 500 bucks. And then I found some for like half that, which was nice. But yeah, you doing all right? Out of pocket, three fifty. Okay. Then I then I wasn't about to get completely bamboozled. I'm gonna head out, but look forward to tuning in the future streams. Thanks so much, Fabulous to Populi. Doing great. Talk with our uncle last night for about an hour. Very nice conversation. Cool. I need to give him a call back and, and thank him because, uh, whoops, I pre-moved. He sent me a book. I haven't got around to reading it yet, which is one of the reasons why I haven't called him to thank him. But Holy fucking sheep shit. Do it again. I'm, evidently my brain is not working, so. He asked me if you'd read it yet. I told him you most certainly would read it. Yep. Got a prophecy for you. Soon may the Wellerman come to bring us sugar and tea and rum one day. When the tonguing is done, we'll take our leave and go. That's not a prophecy.
Hopefully you got all the gear set up and working. The mic placement is very nice and the video and audio quality is nice. Thanks. Uh, the laptop that I bought is a brick and I'm going to have to go on trouble so, uh, tech support and re replace it. Uh, basically, there's a cracked screen that happened evidently when I picked it up and moved it from one side of the desk to another. Uh, I don't know. So, I, But I have to worry about that tomorrow because I've got a debate tonight. Um, the... Video switcher works. I'm leaving it alone and not changing it at all. Uh, not changing anything so that I can get the debate done tonight. And then after that, I'll be fine. But yeah, it's, um, it's okay. I'm, I'm gradually getting closer and closer to, you know, kind of being done with stuff or close to done. Really? I don't know where your queen can go from here. Where can we watch the debate? Holy crap. Oh, resignation. Well, you, I, I, I sucked worse the first time, KVD. There's the link to the debate tonight. Debates with Trent Horn. All right, let me do another one minute. I don't like five, but. I won by resignation. Who does that? Do more tonight. Teach your face palms and gestures towards the three foot writing on the board. Well, there's not three foot writing on the board here. Yeah, that, I, I get that, man, Amanda, which is why I went to Walmart. Which.
Did I just completely fuck this whole thing up? That was a mistake. He had mate and missed it. He had mate and missed it. You get excited doing a debate, no. Are you gonna drink a pint on the debate, no? You bought Maker's Mark today, awesome. Matt's going to get stream sniped on chess. Doubt it. And why would anybody do that? I just play for fun and I'm not very good, so. God damn it. How do you fucking get into this bad of shape just trading stuff off? Oh, and I fucking already did that, so I can't. Um, shit. I genuinely don't believe this is fucking happening. Oh, my fucking, man, my brain is not working at all today. I'm losing at 900s. What's the debate topic? Can we watch it live? When and where? Jesus fucking Christ. I've been streaming for an hour and 20 minutes and have cut and pasted the same thing over and over and over again. Despite, And I've also posted it on Twitter and Facebook. Granted, I've had lots of text issues this week, so I haven't done a very good job of uh, keeping things updated. Really? Uh. 
have a feeling this guy's just going to get dog stomped. Now what? I told you that guy was going to get stomped. The chess opponent is who I was talking about. That whole, let's push all the pawns forward. All right, one last game, and then I got to go eat. Wow. I don't know how I missed that. Stupid, easy, obvious trick is stupid, easy, and obvious. for the queen.
God damn it, fucking. Why did I not hear a click or anything to know that I was about out of time? Whenever I time out, it's always a surprise to me. I hear that sound, but I don't hear the sound that lets me know, hey, you only got like five seconds left. Is there a fucking setting where I can go in and change when the timeout notifications are? Oh my God, that was, that was annoying. That was a terrible game from both sides. All right, now this is the last one, no matter what. Okay, I'll take a win by resignation. I thought I timed out right there. I was like, how the fuck did I time out again? I thought it was moving really, fa really fast. Okay, let me get caught up on chat, and then I'm going to go eat and get ready for a debate. Are you guys still planning on having some of your current co-hosts on the ATX after the pandemic via video calls like now once you have a live audience again? Okay, ATX, I'm assuming you mean AXP, but, or Atheist Experience. Um, we haven't talked about, well, all the current co-hosts live in Austin. For Atheist Experience, oh, no, 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 that's not true. Shannon's not here. So, yes, even after the pandemic, Shannon will still be a co-host on Atheist Experience. But we haven't had talks about going back to the building or anything. Have you checked out the documentary on how pawns and kings mate to create king pawn? What? Have fun at the debate. I will. Nice fork. Hog this. Yeah, everything's weird. That string of expletives really tickled me. It's, well, it's like, I think I've got plenty of time and all of a sudden, boom, I just lost on time. Holy crap. Just because God don't let him go to him. Get some food, have to run to a meeting, talk later. Yes, I, I'm tomorrow I'm gonna be on with tech support and stuff, Brad, so I'll talk to you soon. Love you. Have fun at the debate. Yep. I'm gonna laugh behind the glass back. Enjoy your meal, sir. Can't wait for the debate. Ryan cheered four hundred bets. Thank you for the bits. Appreciate it. Uh, I'm going to end the stream now. So y'all be good and nice and safe and awesome and take care of yourself. And uh, checked King Pawn, mate, King Pawn. I have no idea what you're talking about, Blazing Wizard Pope, but y'all have fun. No, 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 no. You're done. <laughs>